Good morning, I'm Trish Pahanik, and this is Synopsis, your first early morning briefing. Today is Tuesday, December 16th, 2008. Here are today's top stories. Animal Planet is going to the dogs next month as Saturday primetime includes two series featuring canines. Beginning on January 3rd at 8pm, the network premieres the new series Underdog to Wonder Dog, following the Doggy Wonder Team as they make over shelter dogs to land a loving home. At 9pm, new episodes of It's Me or the Dog will debut, hosted by dog trainer Victoria Stilwell. Beginning this month, SoapNet will air a package of 19 movies the network acquired from Sony Pictures Television, Inc. for its 10 p.m. Sunday night movie franchise. Examples of the theatrical titles include Hitch, Fun with Dick and Jane, Something's Gotta Give, Sleepless in Seattle, My Best Friend's Wedding, Jerry Maguire, as well as others. While heating up a cold January, will be Fox's American Idol slated to return for an eighth season with a two-night, four-hour premiere at 8 p.m. on January 13th and 14th. The new season begins with three weeks of audition episodes until January 29th, followed by Hollywood Round episodes on February 3rd, with the first viewer voting starting February 17th. American Idol is produced by 19 Entertainment and Fremantle Media North America. Fox is getting fired up over a fifth season of Hell's Kitchen, opening January 29th at 9 p.m. Chef Gordon Ramsay will preside over 16 aspiring chefs who are vying for the head chef position at the Borgata Hotel Casino and Spa. The competition series is produced by Grenada America and A. Smith and Company. Also on January 29th, Spike TV lassos in the new sports competition series, Toughest Cowboy, at 11 p.m. From producer Mark Burnett, the eight-episode, 60-minute series follows a dozen Daredevil Cowboys taking on three rodeo stunts each night, competing in cities such as Chicago, Atlanta, Indianapolis, Columbus, Raleigh, and Minneapolis-St. Paul. The final Toughest Cowboy Championship will win the Deed to a Ranch in the Rocky Mountains of Wyoming. Toughest Cowboy is the first project from the deal between Mark Burnett Productions and AEG announced earlier this year. Continuing with its Real Housewives franchise, Bravo renewed The Real Housewives of Atlanta, produced by True Entertainment. In its last season, the series averaged 1.13 million adults 18 or 49 and 1.49 million total viewers. And last up today, BBC America acquired the series sequel to Life on Mars, currently airing on ABC, Ashes to Ashes, with 16 one-hour episodes produced by Kudos Film and Television in association with Monastic Productions and distributed by BBC Worldwide, follows the same characters as they descend into the 80s. BBC America will premiere the series in March of 2009. Well, that's going to be it. Be sure to check your email for the full printed version of today's synopsis with new executive moves, more on ratings, a couple new classified ads, and a few of the bits and pieces that did not make it into this podcast, and of course, tonight's primetime broadcast lineup. This is a Synopsis Media production in association with 311 West. For Cynthia Turner, who wrote and compiled Synopsis in Connecticut, I'm Trish Pahonik. I'm going to have a good day. Even if I make it myself, I'm going to have a good day. I don't need no one else. I'm going to have a good day. Nothing wrong I could do. I'm going to have a good day. Hope you have a good day, too.